That knowledge cannot make you calm. To the knowledge of this truth. For how many years did I study science and it didn't bring me to the knowledge of the truth of redemption? For many years do you try to have this knowledge, that knowledge, and you've gone to the apex of learning. And that does not bring you to the knowledge of the truth of redemption. But now, hearing about Christ, now, believing on Christ, now, knowing that Christ is Savior and Lord, we come to the knowledge of the truth. And the truth you have had tonight will set you free. Look at verse 6. There he tells us in verse 6, who gave himself a ransom, who gave himself a ransom for all, for all, my brother there for all, my dear sister there for all, my boy, my, my daughter there for all, is giving himself for you as a ransom. I said he gave himself for you as a ransom. And tonight, it brings you redemption. Where are you? I say, it brings you redemption. Who gave himself a ransom for all to be testified in due time. Testified in due time. That my son there will testify in due time. Daughter there, you'll testify in good time. In due time, that he redeems you from slavery. He redeems you from sin. He redeems you from Satan. He redeems you from sickness. He redeems you from substance. He, de he redeems you from self. Your redemption is available now. My redemption is available now. And whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved salvation for you what are you salvation for you redemption for you release for you liberation has come for you and deliverance has come for everyone tonight in jesus name it's bowed and eyes closed it's bowed and eyes closed there's no excuse for you not to be saved tonight. There's no excuse for you not to be redeemed tonight. Tonight is your day of redemption. Because you're seeking soul. You're seeking the Lord. I need my sins to be taken away. You're seeking the Lord. I need all this substance to be taken away from my hand. You're seeking the Lord. I need Satan's hand to be blown up. And to be streaking up out of my life. That's tonight he wants to do because Christ had given himself for you, a ransom for your soul, the redeemer of your soul. It's bowed and eyes closed. You want this freedom, forgiveness and freedom from sin, from slavery. From substance, from self-destructive attitude and action. You want to be saved, set free from Satan himself who comes to kill, to destroy, to steal. And you want that redemption now, which he will give you tonight, total, complete redemption, wherever you are. You raise up your hand. Check up your life. That sin will ruin you and drive you to hell. Hell fire forever and ever. But now redemption is presented unto you. Redemption is given unto you. And you're saying, Lord, I need that. I want that. I want your redemption, Christ has given himself a ransom for all. Raise up your hand wherever you are, to the right, to the left, to the center, to the back, anywhere you are, you are hearing the sound of the preacher's voice. Raise up that hand. God bless you there. As you're raising up your hand, 
You want to stand up for that redemption. You stand up now. You stand up now. Don't delay. Don't delay, dally. Don't reason here and there. And don't deny your chance, your opportunity of being redeemed, forgiven, freed today. Raise up your hand and stand up online anywhere you are. You raise up your hand, you stand up, and you're saying, Lord, here I come. I believe that Christ has paid the price and has given himself a ransom for my soul. Anywhere you are, you stand up. While you are raising up your hand, tell the Lord right there, Lord Jesus, I come out of my sin. Lord Jesus, I drop the substance that is killing me, destroying my life. Lord Jesus, I run away from all those satanic activities and I break the satanic covenant that I had. I turn to Christ, Jesus, my Savior, my only Savior. Tell him, tell him, I come and I receive Jesus as my personal Savior. And I will not go back away from him anymore. Tell him, whosoever shall call and the name of the Lord shall be saved. Call upon him with all your heart. I receive Christ as my Savior, as my Redeemer, as the ransom given for me as my redemption. Amen. Amen. Keep on standing and keep up that hand. I'm praying with you as well as praying for you. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, you see everyone wholeheartedly, genuinely, sincerely coming to you now, making Jesus the Redeemer, making Jesus the Savior, making Jesus the ransom for their soul. I pray, receive every one of them in Jesus' name. Forgive their sin. Blot out all their transgression and let the Spirit of God be witness with their hearts. They are now children of God. And I pray this redemption will be a real redemption. I pray the slavery you will cut off from their lives. The seas you will bear away to the depths of the sea. Never to be remembered against them anymore. And I pray that the substance will not have any appeal to them anymore in Jesus' name. That Satan will not be their Lord anymore because Jesus is now their Savior. Confirm their salvation by your spirit witnessing in their hearts in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. We know it is done. In Jesus' name we pray. Another amen. God bless you. Keep on standing. Our officiating overseer tonight will come and lead us in this session of, uh, you know, taking the names and getting all the details. And after that, redemption from every sickness will come upon your life. Amen. You are happy for Jesus. Shout hallelujah. All our brethren, our friends who made decision, please keep standing. Uh, ushers, counselors, choristers, they are by you there. They'll give you a form, feel free, and give them necessary information about you. I know you want to continue. 
I know you want to make it to heaven. You had that our brother who testified how God delivered him, healed him, blessed his family. That's what the Lord will do for you. So stand until you get your name recorded and uh, so we can, you know, be in contact with you and we'll be able to help you more in every area, spiritually, physically, and any area of your needs. The Lord will help you. And tomorrow <clears throat> by 3 p.m., we're going to have a rally for you. We'll be giving you more details about that. But right now, please give us your details. Now you are born again. Now you are a child of God. You cannot lie. You cannot give fake names or fake phone numbers. Give us your correct names or your popular names. The names that when we call it where you are living, We'll be able to identify you. Give them the names in brackets, a kind of a AKA name with which you are known. And then your correct uh, phone number, 11 digits. Please, all our ushers, all our leaders, counselors, choristers, the Lord strengthen you as you get their details. Please do that quickly. Do that quickly. As I said, tomorrow, 3 p.m., we'll be having lunch hour with Jesus. A time you will be led into principles, fundamentals, that will help you to stand strong and live an overcoming life as a believer. It will be under that uh, uh, roof, the pavilion, by my left hand side. You will see it there. That's where we are going to have the lunch hour with Jesus. Please be there. 2.30, you are there already praying. Uh, 3 o'clock, we start the teaching and the interaction. Very, very important. And those who are online, you will see a link there. Give us your details. Click it. Uh, it will open up where you fill your details. And after that, you send it to us. Please, that is very important. So that we can also be in contact with you. Let's do that. Let's do that quickly. It's a wonderful thing to come to the Lord. It's a wonderful thing to be saved. It's a wonderful thing to have all your sins forgiven. All. All. Now you are free. As you have made up your mind, as you have trusted the Lord, as you have confessed your sins, as you have believed in Him, no matter what your past was, the Lord has canceled them. He has erased them. Now you are a happy person. Now you are a free person. Now you have peace in your heart. Now you have joy in your soul. Give them the details as they request from you. If you can write, collect the forms and write. If you cannot, they will help you to do so. Our choristers. Our counselors, please do that quickly. Don't leave anybody out. If you have not given them your details, please, if you don't mind, keep standing up until they have gotten your details. Keep standing until they have gotten your details. Please, it's very, very important. So that the devil will not trick you back into sin as you have decided for the Lord, stand for the Lord. Stand up, stand up for Jesus. Those who have made decisions online, the social media, on the 
television, in your handsets, please. You will have a link there that will show up. Now click it and fill your details and send to us. So we can be in contact with you all over, everywhere, and in all other locations in Nigeria, in Africa, and beyond. Do the same. Do what we are doing now. This is the important moment when souls are registered in the kingdom of God. In the kingdom of God. Not just that we are registering your name here. Heaven has already registered your name. So be happy. Do whatever you are doing with joy. And say, now I'm a child of God. Now my sins are forgiven. Now I'm born again. Now I am on my way to heaven. Let's remember the lunch hour with Jesus, 3 p.m. Under the covered pavilion by my left side. As you are coming in here, you will see it on the right. All those who have made decisions yesterday and today, please be there by 3 p.m. Be there by 3 p.m. And as you come, we'll have some time with you. After that, we we'll join the crusade. So be prepared when you are coming. You will not need to go home again after that. Three, four, five, the crusade will start. Our leaders, if you are finished on my left side, at the middle here, on my right side, please indicate. If you have finished, if you have taken all the names, wave your hand, wave your flag, let's know that you are true. Okay, I'm seeing that flag there. God bless you. At the far back, at the far back, if you have finished there, let's see you wave the flag. In the middle section here, in front, at the back, if you have finished, please wave your flag. Let us see. Let's hasten, let's hasten. And on my left hand side, if you have finished, please wave your flag. Wave your flag in the front, at the back. I'm not yet seeing any flag. And those of us who are sitting down, please continue to pray and expect your miracle. A miracle must come upon you tonight. A miracle must come upon you tonight. Yes. If you are finished, please wave your flag. I'm only seeing the flag on the right. We're expecting from the back, from the middle here, front and back, on the left-hand side, front and back. Okay, we're seeing flag at the far back. What of the front here? The front here and the front here. If you are finished, please wave your flag. Let us see. Thank you very much at the far back of my right. We are still waiting for the middle here. If you have finished, please wave your flag. Okay, God bless you. On the left side, if you have finished, wave your flag. Thank you. At the far back, in the middle, at the far back in the middle, if you have finished, we are waiting for you. Please wave your flag at the back, far back, far back. Seeing all the people at the far back. Are there people there? Okay, thank you, brother, in front here. We're waiting for the far back. We're waiting for the far back. Are there leaders there? Are there workers there? Please, if you have finished, wave your flag at the back, at the far back. Okay, those who have made decisions online, this is the number you can uh, text your name 
and your details too. Plus two three four nine one five four 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 nine two six three. Plus two three four nine one five triple four nine two six three. I take it one more time. Plus two three four nine one five. Four 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 nine two six three. That's a WhatsApp number. You can send all your details onto us through text message or WhatsApp message. Thank you very much. I think we are set now. Yes, those are the back. My seeing your flag. Your flag. Yes, God bless you. Yes, God bless you. Yes, God bless you. Pray. The Lord. Everybody shout miracle time. miracle time. Shout it to confuse the devil. Miracle time. One more time. Get ready. The man of God is here. Praise the Lord. Redemption from all sicknesses. This is my day of redemption. Because I am a seeking soul. What you are seeking, you will get. Freedom, you will get. Healing, you will get. Deliverance, you will get. Liberation, you have it tonight. You raise up your hand. You lay the other hand where you have the challenge. And that sickness you see now, you'll see it no more after the final amen. amen. Healed. Healed. Amen. I am the healed of the Lord. I am. I am the healed of the Lord. Let the Redeemer confirm that in your life. Yeah. Raise up the hand. Let the other hand where you have the challenge, you are redeemed from all sicknesses. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we come to you knowing you've given Jesus as a ransom, as a Redeemer from all sicknesses. And Lord, I pray that redemption from every form of sickness come upon everyone now in Jesus' name. Amen. Give them recovery. Amen. Give them total healing. Amen. Give them the miracle of the hour in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, I pray from the crown of the head to the tip of their toe, the soles of their feet. Let healing come to everyone now in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, I pray that all the brain problem, madness, is uh, that the kind of lunatic spirit come out in Jesus' name. Amen. Every bad thing and evil thing the substance has done in your brain, in your body. You are released now. You are redeemed now. You are healed and delivered in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, I pray for those that have any problem in their blood system. Whatever the description of the problem. Touch them. Heal them in Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, I pray for those who have cancer. They don't have cancer anymore. I pray that that cancer will go back to where it came from. Lord Jesus who went about doing good and healing all that were oppressed of the devil because God was with you and God is still here today with us. I pray that that cancer be healed in Jesus' name. Also, pack your load and go. I pray for that ulcer patient. Touch him, touch her. 
heal them in Jesus' name. The pile, I pray that right now instantaneously be healed of that pile in Jesus' name. Swelling with pain in the body. Lord, I pray, fibroid, come out in Jesus' name. Elephantiasis, be gone in Jesus' name. The Lord on the neck, goiter, be healed in Jesus' name. And the swollen tummy, that tummy, come down to normal in Jesus' name. All the skin disease and the scratches and everything in her, you're healed of skin disease in Jesus' name. The boil that has been there for a long time, dry up now in Jesus' name. Eyes bringing out water, water every time as if you are crying every moment, dry up now in Jesus' name. Demon eyesight. Whatever is called glaucoma, cataract, whatever, be healed in Jesus' name. For the weakness of the nurse there that you can't see properly, as you open your eyes now, see bright and clear in Jesus' name. The deaf and the dumb, I pray the Lord will touch your ears and touch your vocal cords. Speak out in Jesus' name and hear very well in jesus name i pray for those who are lame rise up and walk i pray for those one leg shorter than the other short leg grow out in jesus name arthritis pain can't raise up the hand in the elbow in the shoulder in the wrist any kind of stiffness in your joints in your waist on your knees ankle be released in jesus name i pronounce healing everywhere to the right healing to the left healing at the center in the middle at the back healing online everywhere healing yeah. miracle yeah. deliverance yeah. total redemption has come for you yeah. lord confirm it in every life yeah. thank you lord thank you lord thank you lord it is done in jesus name we pray You have got your own tonight. You have got your own tonight. Check up, check up, check up. There's a miracle there with your name attached onto it. Check up, check up, check up, check up. Catch your miracle now. It is done. I say it is done. I say it is done. I say it is done. Check up, check up, check up. Take up your body now. The miracle is here. Rise up and walk. Rise up and walk. Open your eyes and see. Jump up from your wheelchair. Jump up. The Lord has done it. Take up now. And you see it is done. You begin to shout your hallelujah. You praise the Lord. And we join you. No going anywhere. No going anywhere. This time of celebration. This time of celebration, check up, rise up, jump up, walk around, open your eyes, and see the miracle. See the miracle. Right there on my left, the word has gone out. The word has gone out. The healing is there with you. Catch it now and begin to come out. Begin to come out. Check up, check up, check up, check up. Check up. No movement, no movement. This is the time. To allow God to walk, let God walk now. Let God walk now. Don't remain on the wish here. Rise up. Throw away your clothes and begin to march out here. Begin to march out. Begin to march out. Begin to march out. Begin to march out. The Lord has done it. The word has gone forth. He sent his word and he healed them. Tonight is your night. Tonight is your night. 
Tonight is your night. No movement, no movement. Come out, let's celebrate. Come out, let's celebrate. Where are you? Where are you? Come out, come out, come out. You see the Lord has touched you? Come out. From my left, from my right, from the back, from the center. Come out, come out, come out. The miracle is here. The miracle is with you. The miracle is with you. The miracle is with you. Come out, come out, come out. Come out, come out. The Lord has done it. Yes. Check up now. Check up now. It's happening there now. It's happening in your body now. It's happening in your body now. Check up, check up, check up, and come forward. Come forward, come forward. Our workers, ushers, others, help them. Check up what God has done and bring them out. Bring them out. The Lord has done it. The Lord has done it. The miracle has happened. The word has gone forth. Come out now. Come out now. We are waiting for your testimony. We are waiting for your testimony. The bosses are there for you. No hurrying. No hurrying. Come out. Come out. Come out. The Lord has touched you. The Lord has healed you. Come out. Demonstrate your faith. Demonstrate your faith. Sitting down will not help you. Wake up. Stand up. Walk out. Walk out. Come to the front here. Come to my left hand side. Left hand side. Yes. Rise up. Rise up. Let us sing. Rise up. Rise up. Rise up. Rise up. As you are checking, you are coming out. As you are checking, you are coming out. As you are checking, you are coming out. hands together for the Lord. Clap, 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 clap. The more you clap, the more your miracle manifests. The more you clap, the more your blessing will manifest. The more you clap, uh, you can clap better than that. Let the devil hear you are clapping. 
Let the devil hear you are clapping. Let the devil hear you are clapping. Clapping for Jesus. Clapping for your miracle. Amen. Praise the Lord. Now check up, check up. Something is happening there. And many people are already trooping out. Join them. Join them. Don't remain on the wish here. Join them. Open your eyes and look. You will see the bright light. You will see everything clearly. Check up, check up, check up, check up. The Lord is doing it already. It is done already. Our leaders go to the places where the, to the place where the people have come out already. Okay, okay, sir. Give us more song. Let's sing, let's sing, let's sing. Let's sing. And you check up here, sir. back home. Let me hear a good amen. Reject it and rise and walk. Now we begin to listen to testimony now. Quickly, quickly. And you'll be checking up yourself and you'll continue to come out. Something is happening tonight. I say something is happening tonight. Here's the first testifier. I'm Dr. Asogwa Promise. Uh, this is Gloria Ugu with a striking testimony. Let's listen to her. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Praise the Lord! My sisters and brothers, my brethren, I am so happy I don't know where to start. This is my sickness, arthritis and rheumatism. For close to two years now, I cannot walk. I cannot stand. I've gone to all the hospitals. I can go to UNTH, orthopedic, everywhere, back lane, all the x ray, all the scan. They can't see anything. But I cannot walk. I cannot stand. When I was coming, even yesterday, today, it's like this. My sister, they'll be holding me. For me to get up, they will hold me and help me, even in the camp today. But after the last amen, hey! Something says, stood up. I stood up. I was jumping. I said, my sister, come and see the Lord has done it. Praise the Lord. If you have hands, jam it together. Jam the hand. Can you see she's dancing? She's celebrating. Go and enjoy your miracle. Doctor, anything to say? My sister had severe osteoarthritis that caused flexion deformity. He couldn't walk for a year and two months. He was aided 
even to, to this place. But after the prayer of our Father and the Lord tonight, she stood up and began to walk, and we can see her walking. Her you can see, clap your something. hand again. Your own miracle is there. Say it, my own miracle is here. Shout it, my own miracle is here. Devil will not take it away from you. You can see it. Another testimony. This is Bro Ongwa Mechi. Let's listen to his testimony. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Our God is good. My name is Brother Onwe Amechi. I'm worshiping in Deeper Life Bible Church, Ozilo District, under Liberty this, uh, Group of Nike Region. Praise the Lord. I'm here this hour to testify of the goodness of God in the life of my wife. Praise the Lord. My, my wife is uh, supposed to be here with me, but she just put to bed of a bouncing baby boy. Praise the Lord. My brothers and sisters, God did wonderful things in the life of my wife. During divine touch for total freedom, God visited my wife in a special measure. Praise the Lord. During that period, as we, we, we are uh, moving around, telling people of that very wonderful program that is forthcoming during that very period, uh, enemy just brought a distraction. Praise the Lord. But I were not moved because... I, ha I know that name that is above every other name. Tell us, tell us, tell us. What Praise the Lord. The Lord. And my wife started developing uh, a growth on her left breast. And I was, I was very surprised. We started moving from one chemist shop to, other, to another. All to no avail, there was no solution. And some, uh, one of the nurse, nurse there told us that we ought to go for a test. But to the things they are demanding from us, I myself, I did not have any. I just summoned uh, courage and told my wife that this crusade that is forthcoming, that we are going to trust God. Because we have been hearing testimonies of what God is doing. This time is our own time. So we are going for this crusade. And before the crusade we finish, God is going to touch your life. And every work of the devil towards your life will be crushed. Praise the Lord. And that is how God took control. We went for this divine touch for total freedom 2021 and the first day second day to the fifth day nothing happened i told my wife when i woke up in the morning that day i told her that me and every one of us in this house we are not going to eat we are going to wait for the lord from morning till four o'clock and I know that after this, God is going to do something in your life. We waited. Till 4 o'clock, we closed our prayer. We went for the program in the evening time by 5. The, when the program started, after the ministration of the man of God, my wife, after the prayer, and everything, my wife just ran to me and told me that, Daddy, something happened in my breast. I said, what? She said that she wants to go and give testimony. I told her, wait, till we confirm before we come out to give testimony. 
So we waited until the program finished. As we reached to, my, to the house, as we reached to the house, my wife started vomiting. And after that vomit, everything just stopped. Praise the Lord! And that is how God healed my wife even to today. My wife is just celebrating his healing, nothing anymore. Amen! Look at how you are clapping. What is taking the life of many people? Trusting the Lord and it is all. It is all gone. The, That's the how is your own problem is gone tonight. I say your own problem is gone tonight. Whatever is the name, at the name of Jesus. And the man of God has prayed in the name of Jesus. And we said what? Amen. And your problem is over. Doctor, can we hear? The wife of our brother had an open wound on the left nipple with pus. Pus exuding from the, from the wound. But during Divine Touch 2021, after the prayer of our Father and the Lord on the fifth day, the Lord healed the wife, the pus, you know, everything ceased, and today she's very, really whole. One more clap offering for the Lord Jesus. Rise up, rise up, let us sing a little, and then you check up yourself, and you come out. Tonight is celebration night. Celebration. 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 Rise up, rise up, rise up. Satan must pack his load and live your life. Another testimony. Our brother here, God's time, Francis, has a wonderful testimony. Let's listen to him. Where's that Lord? My name is Francis, God's time. I'm from Barak District. I want to thank the Lord for what the Lord has done for me. Last, two, last week, I have a, a chest pain. I told my mom, my mom said, let me continue be praying. When I, when I come to this GCK, when uh, Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumi is um, saying, wear your hand when you have a challenge, I wear my hand in my chest, and the Lord healed me. I have a short pain in my chest, and the Lord healed me. Praise the Lord. Put your hand together. It's touching the children. It's touching the adults. It's touching the men. It's touching the women. It's touching me. I say it's touching me. I say it's touching me. And it will be permanent in your life. Yes. A little brother here had pain on the chest. And what he told us initially too, he had painful swallowing, what we call odinophagia. But after the prayer of our Father and the Lord tonight, the pains on the chest, on the truth, vanished. Amen. Vanish. Please, everybody say, vanish. That's how your problem will vanish. Another testimony. Let's listen to our brother Favor with a wonderful testimony. Praise the Lord. My name is Okobia Favor. I want to actually thank God for what He has done in my life. 
I think last year, May, during the May GCK, before the May GCK started, the Jesus the Brito, that was the team. I was having this pain on my mouth, in my mouth. It was so severe on Tuesday. On Wednesday, it became more severe. On Thursday, it was just so worse. So after my exam that Thursday, I went to church. Why the man of God was praying? He said, lay your hands on the pain. Lay your hands wherever you're having the pain. So I laid my hands on my mouth. I prayed and I believed God. I went back home. Despite the pain was still there, but I told myself that I'm healed. That, yes, I've gotten my miracle. So the next day, which was Friday, I woke up with this song. Even when I don't see him, he's working. Even when I don't feel it, he's working. He never stop. He never stop working. So I was singing that song, singing it throughout that day. And during that evening, I just discovered that the pain was gone. Praise the Lord. So you will discover your pain is what? Say, I, the pain is what? Say it one more time. The pain is and it will never come back in Jesus' name. Amen. Our brother had painful sensation in his mouth, the book of cavity. But after the prayer, the Lord took the painful sensation away. Remember what the Lord has done for you. Don't hide it. Come out. Come out. Come out. Can we go to social media now? And let's hear from the social media before we continue here. Indeed, it is a night of redemption from sicknesses. As we are experiencing the power of God, not just only at the Alpha location, rolling away sickness, we also have testimonies online of what God is doing in the life of people as we bring you this testimony from the online community. Oh yes, indeed, God is doing great things. From the General Superintendent's Facebook page, Akinola Bukola writes, Praise the Lord, I just confirmed my healing from inner weakness and chest congestion. Hallelujah. And Zege Samuel has this to say, I have been healed from serious back pain, which has been going on from one month now. Completely healed and delivered. Hallelujah. Also from the YouTube page, Helen Olumafin says, I am healed of pain in my back and hip pain. Immediately, the man of God mentioned my case. I am healed and totally free. Praise the Lord. Eunice has this to say. Praise the Lord for delivering me from difficulty in Britain. Praise the Lord. Many more testimonies will bring you as we return to the Alpha location for more testimonies. Yeah, the next testimony, please. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's listen to our brother, Victory Fechuku. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God bless you all. Oh, kaka. Oh, kaka. Eze, ide bube, agi, jire, nube, juwa. My main reason for coming here to testify for the goodness of mercies in my life is restoration of salvation. <laughs> Hallelujah! And also, uh, when uh, the man of God was saying uh, bondage from society, from the society of Oboni, thank God for society bondage release from my life. <laughs> Hallelujah! And also, I thank God for uh, the neck pain in my neck region being relieved today also in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Put your hands together for the Lord. Three in one, restoration, deliverance, healing. Put your hands better for the Lord. Your own miracle is there for you. Yes, next one. Praise the Lord. Let's Amen. listen to Boniface Ugu for what the Lord has, what the Lord did for him. Amen. 
ana me kele chine ke kele ma ke bere ya ni sim ni ho mo ni me nu na ndu mu ni ile na chine ke bo nyinye kam chine ke bo nyi agba to bi mke na nyinu me ka ni fu na zne ka nri beli ile oburu na ogba ji doro na obi abem na chikute ando bi ana gumo yi o ye me nu oku na bu ye koreko oku mu na eko ngbali ile onu ge pe mu ma chima odes su ko ru ku mu hana mo ke gumu je dori joy mane nge mu biar mbe na nko nya ne onwele ku mu mu riri ku nya mu me wo sha na ne an me nwete onwo mu an me olu ku mu hana ime nga na azo ku ku mu nga na si chine ke ya bo nyi ne nyi me ka ya da ro ro ni o mer nendo mu obi abu ihe mje nyi chine ke ke le man ke she mal ke ri pe ri na nyi pe ri mbe na sno ja de na nyi o e ne after me de match ne ke nso ngbe chine ngba onye ndu anyi ben mu ekpere na na tarmi abe ekpere and an ekpere mbo ya ga re ni ru me nwe kpo nwe kpam kpam de ge mu ma mari de match ne ke na la kogma azna ha jesus put your hands together for the lord interpreter please quickly quickly my brother is testifying of what the lord okay my brother is testifying of what the lord has done for him he had this uh, swollen leg for about four months now, and uh, she has gone for medications to no avail. But tonight, when the man of God prayed for him, the swelling vanished, and uh, you can see him demonstrating his leg. He can now walk very well, and he is perfectly healed. Praise the Lord. Rise on your feet and jam your hands together for the Lord as we take this song again. Before we close, please, orchestra, everybody rise up, see what the Lord has done. Sing, sing, sing. Give a good clap offering for our Lord Jesus Christ. See what He has done tonight. See the good weather. See the souls that are saved. You can clap better than that. See the souls that have been delivered. And I know you have your own miracle. Don't hide it. Tomorrow you come and testify. Tell yourself, I will testify. Remember, tomorrow is what? Impart glory to glory. I love that. Impart from glory to glory. We want this whole place to be jam packed tomorrow, 7 30, by all our youths of secondary, tertiary. YPF and others, youth, youth core members, let's all be here. God will take you from glory to glory. Hallelujah. Close your eyes and let's pray and thank God. Begin to bless the Lord for what the Lord has done. Thank Him. Give Him the glory. Return the praise to Him. What He has done is wonderful. Thank Him for the man of God. Thank Him for the strength. Thank you for the word. Thank you for the power. Thank God for what he has done. And pray that all the souls that have been saved, they will abide. And those who have been healed, they will remain healed. And that tomorrow, God will bring us here for the impact, for the uh, lunch hour with Jesus, and for the crusade proper. In Jesus' name we pray. A ringing amen. A 
Satan demobilizing. Amen. Father, we thank you. We bless your name. You have done great things, O oh God. We rejoice. And we return all the glory, honor, praise, adoration, thanksgiving unto you in Jesus' name. Thank you for those who are saved. Help them to remain saved. Thank you for those who are healed, delivered. Keep them saved and healed and delivered. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we lift up your servant, the man of God, convener, pastor, doctor, W.F. Kumuyi, more strength, more power, more anointing, more revelation, more wisdom. In the name of Jesus and our mother in the Lord, more grace, more of your spirit. In the name of Jesus. And Lord, we commit tomorrow into your hand. Oh Lord, we have the impact. We have the uh, Converse rally, the Converse launch hour with Jesus. We have the crusade. Oh Lord, greater things for us. Higher things for us. In the name of Jesus. And as we go now, Lord, we cover everyone with the blood of Jesus. All our vehicles, all our buses, all the, the, the means of going home, trekking, whatever, Lord, your divine protection. No evil will come upon anybody. When we go home with testimony, as we are going, more manifestation, more miracles, more of your visitation, more of your power. In the name of Jesus. Tomorrow, Lord, multiply the number of people. Multiply the number of converts. Multiply the miracles. Thank you, Lord, for answering our prayer. In Jesus' glorious name, we pray. Another amen. Final confirmation. Amen. Go in peace. It is well with you. Amen. Amen. Please, if you find any car key. Okay, there is a car key. I am ready for my miracle. My miracle is decreed from heaven. My deliverance decreed from heaven. There's a sure performance in your life. Lord, I pray for everyone to the right, to the left, center to the back. Let your healing power come to every life now. Set them totally free and give them their needed miracle. I am ready for my miracle. My miracle is decreed from heaven. Healing my deliverance decreed from heaven. There's a sure performance in your life. I pray for everyone to the right, to the left, to the center, to the back. Let your healing power come to every life now. Set them totally free and give them their needed miracle.
everything is wrong with you. Don't you give up on you look up. There's an answer to all your questions. We bring you the gospel, it's for every nation. Oh, Jesus. is free, you don't need to pay, but you might have feel there is grace today, yeah. oh, 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 there is healing, deliverance, freedom from hoods of Satan, oh, yeah, this case, yes, so bring your case, come on everybody, take your place, come and experience for me saving grace, no matter your color, no matter your race, Mama, Papa, they come. Okay, why in the ya? Mutu mata so oh, Baba, ya, ewa. Salvation is free, you don't need to pay. All of the shame you will run away. Oh, 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 yeah. There is healing, deliverance, freedom from hoods of Satan. The gospel to every creature. GCK Gospel to every creature. In this crusade, we're talking about the grace of God. From an expression of God's grace to the demonstration of His power, is a man called by God to demystify the compositions of the earth of the Father. Aota River State rejoiced at the consistent expressions of God's mighty move. When the rain was falling earlier in the day, every part, it fell here, fell here, fell there, fell everywhere. And the rain came on everybody, miracle is going to fall like rain. GCK Medical Mission and the Crusade. This mission brought hope and free health services to thousands in need. I was lucky enough to be among the people that got the surgery free of charge, and my surgery was perfect, neat. I don't have complications. I want to return all the glory to all God Almighty. This is the grace of God that brings everything that Calvary has provided for everyone. And now, God's promised power is here. This day is the day of his power. Prepare for an outpouring. GCK live in Enugu. Be ready for a transformative journey into the unmatched power of God. Our dear Father in the Lord, the governor of GCK, Pastor Dr. W. F. Kumuyi. I am ready for my miracle. The miracle is decreed from heaven. Healing my deliverance decreed from heaven. There's a sure performance in your life. Lord, I pray for everyone to the right, to the left, to the center, to the back. Let your healing power come to every life now. Set them totally free and give them their needed miracle. Our dear Father and the Lord, the governor of GCK, Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumuyi. I am ready for my miracle. My miracle is decreed from heaven. Deliverance decreed from heaven. There's a sure performance in your life. Lord, I pray for everyone to the 
the right of the left, center to the back. Let your healing power come to every life now. Set them totally free and give them their needed miracle. Uh, dear Father in the Lord, the Convener of GCK, Pastor Dr. W. F. Kumuyi. I am ready for my miracle. My miracle is decreed from heaven. Healing my deliverance decreed from heaven. As a sure performance in your life. Lord, I pray for everyone. Right to the left, center to the back. Let your healing power come to every life now. Set them totally free and give them their needed miracle. Chapter 16, verse 1, you tells us that the preparation of the heart is in man and the answer of the tongue is from God. We ask that, Lord, you'll direct us aright to pray so as to receive. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Before we get into prayer, let's open again. Psalm 110, we'll read verse 3. Psalm 110, verse 3. It says, Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power, in the beauties of holiness, from the womb of the morning, thou hast the dew of thy youth. Thou hast the dew of thy youth. I also want us to read from Psalm 105. In reading from verse 1, it says, Oh, give thanks unto the Lord. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people. Sing unto him. Sing psalms unto him. Talk ye of all his wondrous works. Glory in his holy name. Let the heart of them rejoice that seek the Lord. Seek the Lord and his strength. Seek his face evermore. Remember his marvelous works that he had done, his wonders and the judgments of his mouth. O ye seed of Abraham, his servant, ye children of Jacob, his chosen, he is the Lord our God. His judgments are in all the earth. He has remembered his covenant forever, the word which he commanded to a thousand generations, which covenant he made with Abraham and his oath unto Isaac and confirmed the same unto Jacob for a law and to Israel for an everlasting covenant. Praise the Lord. We want to begin by thanking God for his wondrous works, for his marvelous works. Amen. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Let's begin to thank the Lord for his wonderful works. 
for his marvelous works. Open your mouth and begin to thank the Lord for his wonderful works, for his covenant which he had remembered, which he had confirmed, his everlasting covenant which he had confirmed unto us. We see the hand of the Lord. We see the power of God. We see God in action, walking in our lives. We need to seek him in thanksgiving, in rejoicing. Let our heart rejoice as we stand in the presence of the Lord. Let's remember him. All his works towards us. Let's thank God for what he has done, for what he has been doing in the past GCK through our Father in the Lord, the Convener. Open your mouth and thank God for his wonderful works, for his marvelous works, for the great works God has been doing. Let's thank him for salvation of souls. Let's thank him for miracles, signs, and wonders. Open your mouth. I want to hear you praying. Thanking God for his goodness, for salvation, for restoration. Thank him for miracles, for healing, for deliverance. Diverse signs and wonders that the Lord has done. Through our Father in the Lord, the convener of GCK, open your mouth. The Lord had always remembered. The Lord had always confirmed in every GCK. Since the starting of GCK 2021, God has been confirming his word. God has been confirming his word. God has been confirming his word. God has been making his works manifest in our lives. Open your mouth. Bless the name of the Lord. Worship him. Adore him. Magnify him. Magnify him. Magnify him. In Jesus' name we pray. We pray in Jesus' name. We want to thank God for our daddy, the convener of GCK, who have allowed himself to be used by God. We want to thank God. God has given him to us, to our generation to serve us, to help us, to relieve us, to heal us, deliver us, and to prepare us for his kingdom. Open your mouth. Thank God for this servant of the Lord who allowed himself, who yielded himself into the hand of the Lord for our generation, for our time. Open your mouth wide. Thank the Lord for the servant of the Lord, for our father, the convener of GCK. Pray, thanking the Lord for what God has been using him to do in our lives. In Jesus' name we pray. We want to still thank God for our daddy, for his humility. For his yieldedness, his humbleness in the hand of the Lord. 
let's begin to thank the Lord who has granted him the grace to so humble himself, to so yield himself into the hand of the Lord, to be used, prepared, set aside, sanctified unto all good works. Anywhere, everywhere, any day, any year, and any month, he's yielded. He's willing. He's ready. He is humble, ready for the master's use, ready to go wherever the spirit of the Lord beats him. Open your mouth and thank God for such yieldedness, for such willingness, for such humility. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We want to pray that our daddy's presence in Enugu State for these days will bring about multiple multiplications of blessings for people of Enugu State, Southeast, Nigeria, Africa, and the whole world. Open your mouth, begin to pray that that is present here in Enugu State for this day of God's power will bring multiplications of blessings for the people of God, for the creatures of God, spiritual blessings, material blessings, marital blessings, Pray that daddy's presence, as he stands to declare, to preach, to pronounce the blessings. They will enter, we will receive. It will be multiplication, it will be multiplied upon our lives, upon the people of God. All over the globe, all over the continent of Africa, Nigeria, Southeast, and the people of Enugu State. Pray for multiplication of the blessings of the Lord. These days of his power that his servants stands to declare, that our Father in the Lord stands to declare, thus says the Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. We pray in Jesus' name. We are going to pray that the long arm of the Lord will reach out to everyone, no matter the pit in which or where the problems of life has put us or has put men. The arm of the Lord will reach out to them and get them out of that pit and lift them up and lift them up. Open your mouth and begin to pray. That the hand of the Lord will get us out. We reach out to everyone wherever the problems of life in whichever pit or valley the problems of life have put them down, that the hand of the Lord will lift them up, will set them on their feet, will set them on their feet, will make them stable.
In Jesus' name we pray. Yesterday, the topic of the message was divine human willingness in the days of God's power. We are going to pray that wherever people will be connected, whichever nation, whichever location, either in their house or in the church setup, that the Lord will grant unto everyone that is connected the willingness to surrender himself or herself under God's supernatural power. The willingness to surrender to the word of God, to receive and to believe and to obey the words of God according to the instruction and directions from the servant of the Lord, our daddy, our father, the convener of GCK. Open your mouth and pray that God will grant unto all that hears Unto all that is listening, willingness to surrender ourselves to his supernatural power that comes through the preaching of the word that will be open to receive, we will believe, we will obey and be connected to our blessings, to our salvation, to our healing. Pray, pray for willingness Willingness to surrender. Willingness to surrender to the supernatural power of God. Willingness to surrender to the supernatural power of God. In Jesus' name, we pray. We pray in Jesus' name. Brethren, we are still praying. In Acts chapter 16, reading from verse 4. 